In the average classroom, at least one child will suffer from attention deficit hyperactivity disorder. The three symptoms of ADHD are inattention, hyperactivity and impulsiveness, symptoms that can be controlled by medication. But statistics from the Therapeutic Goods Administration show that in the past year, at least 30 children suffered psychotic incidents while on the medication. Many became so depressed that they wanted to kill themselves. One seven-year-old boy tried to commit suicide. But not all doctors believe there is cause for alarm. Parents do not need to be concerned. If you're seeing your doctor and your paediatrician, you're prescribed a stimulant medication such as Ritalin, it is safe and quite often it is extremely beneficial to the child. There are many non-medical treatments available such as counselling and occupational therapy. Psychiatrists also stress the need for family support. In any one treatment, the medication alone isn't the only way to go. It's a way that makes the child be able to interact with their environment to then start to learn, develop formative experiences and change behaviour. It's not a treatment in itself. Parents with concerns over their child's medication should contact their doctor. John O'Doherty, QUT News.